All right, Graciela, do you agree with that analysis? There's a lot here to celebrate, a commitment towards uh, moving to a non-fossil future, even a mention of 1.5 degrees Celsius as some kind of target that the world needs to keep global warming limited to. The target of 1.5 is certainly very important. However, there is no provision in this agreement about how to get there, and there is no mandatory emission limits that is what is required to get there. So I don't understand what we're celebrating. It's good intentions, very hard work, but in terms of real results, I don't see it. All there is no mandatory commitments of money. There is no mandatory commitments of redu reduction of emissions, which is what is needed and which is what the Kyoto Protocol achieved 18 years ago. There are no mandatory commitments here, none. Okay, let's take that point tomorrow.